Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Oops, this is Adana, also known as the F. Today I've been reading for um, Scorpio and Taurus. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. <laughs> Let's get into it. Yo, I'm really enjoying these letter readings. They are so dope. I love it. We have L and S. So someone could be driving a La Sabra. What kind of car is they? I think that's a Lincoln. A Buick. All right, someone is driving a Buick. Le Sabre, L-E-S-A-B-R-E. -E. You might be having issues with your car. I feel like you've had a car, a really good car. And something happened where you may have to give it away or you may have to like downsize. All right, we have PG here. Keep it PG. Somebody may cuss a lot or somebody think that you may curse a lot. Somebody, somebody may think that you're a pig. Somebody may think that you are a slop or a slob. They may think that you're very lazy. Somebody needs to get a grip on life. They're slipping. Somebody's taking pills. Somebody's going to be begging for um, forgiveness here. Please, I keep hearing, please, please, please. I, I beg you, please. Three, four, five. Yeah, change. Yep. PLS, please. Let me show y'all. I'm hearing, please. Somebody listen to Heavy D. Please don't squeeze the Charmin. <laughs> W and R. Somebody's wrong here. Somebody's in the wrong here. expectations of you but they're wrong okay so they could be oh somebody slipped up and said this out of anger towards someone and their true feelings came out yeah they've been very raw in regards to how they feel about you but not towards you towards somebody else i'm here in rwanda so you could be from the country of rwanda or you may have watched hotel rwanda here Infinity, Destiny, Magic. Their magic is backfiring, the alchemist. So I feel like someone may have been projected or may actually be doing some candle work on you, but it is actually project. Uh, it's actually failing. Somebody has stepped, the last time I read for um, Scorpio and Taurus, somebody was suffering from sepsis here. And I feel like they're suffering from sepsis because of the, the magic that they were doing. It completely backfired. All of the talking and the backbiting and all the lies and slanders that this person was doing towards you, it is now starting to come out and people are now starting to see this person true colors here. This person may be um, trying to intimidate you. Um, they may stalk you as well too. They may use your past against you to make you feel bad about yourself. But this person has sepsis. <laughs> They got more important things to be worried about than worry about you, or worry about lies, and worry about standards. <coughs> Excuse me, that they're trying to um, create unnecessarily here. Child, get the f out of here, child. <laughs> Woo. 
So we have, um, so those are baby puppies. They're puppies in the background if you hear that little crying, okay? Um, so that could be like a cry for help, okay? Because um, Arturians, and then we have the Merkaba feeling safe, um, wisdom keepers concerned. So you may have been concerned about this person that was stalking you, that was talking stuff up behind your bed. Um, but with the Merkaba here, movement, long distance, travel, and excitement, you're ready to move forward. So you might be moving to a new place, a new city, a new country. I'm actually feeling like a new country. You may start with a new city first and then move out to the country. It could be the country in the United States or it could be the country in a different um, a different country, like international country. But I see you wanting to move um, to some kind of country or something, like France or something like that. All right, somebody thinks that you're boring, that you're not fun. You may do the same thing day in and day out and they think that's boring. Somebody just trying to dictate your life, but literally somebody is sick here. Somebody is slipping. I'm hearing I'm slipping, I'm falling. I can't get up. Somebody may be breaking out in hives, okay? Their perspective is flawed as to how they see you or how they perceive you. All right, this is family, but it's not family. So it could be a family member that's doing this, but they're not considered your family because of the bullshit that they're doing, okay? They may try to silence you. They, they may feel like you speak too much, okay? You're going through a rebirth now, and your rebirth is a form of speaking, okay? Now you're wanting to speak up and speak out of the things that has happened because you are cleansing yourself, okay? You could be that dark skin girl. Shit, look. Shit. You could be that whole dark skin girl, child. That's wearing this crown because you have a bigger vision or you see your vision and you're going to move forward with your vision. But you had somebody that you had to either leave behind or somebody is really sick. I feel like somebody's coming back in because they feel like you have the knowledge to assist them with um, healing somebody's gay here. They're not open, they're not open, open with it. Family-wise, but other other areas they're open. So like friends and, and and with their significant other, they're open with them. But when it comes to family, they're not open with family. But this person is secretly gay. We have D and N. Uh I'm here in dining, so you may be trying to go out to eat, to like a little small diner, okay? Somebody likes diner food, like pancakes and waffles, all right? Um, somebody, somebody feels you're dingy, what the hell? Okay, whatever. Um, yeah, somebody, somebody says you're dingy. They mad as shit. <laughs> Jog, so you may be going for a jog or the jig is up. I feel like more so the jig is up. You're now starting to see the person, true colors. Their mask has completely fallen off. Again, this was your family, but you don't consider them to be family. So, uh, you know, if everything is silent. You may not have spoken to this person. This person's not speaking to you. They may be coming to you as a resolution. Okay, they had to rest themselves to kind of see what they can do, what they can say. This could be a brother as well. I'm definitely hearing brother. Um, could be a, a, a taller brother, but young. So he's taller than you, but he's younger than you, okay? There's some form of a, a, a weird, sick obsession or of, of just trying to watch you or addicted to you to kind of see what you're doing, all right? But you are the high priestess. You are, you are aware of everything that's going on, okay? You might be in the Nine of Cups energy with wealth. I'm here in Australia too, so somebody will be trying to, trying to uh, travel to Australia or may have traveled to Australia because dingy or dingy, D-I-N, I think it's D-I-N-G-H-Y. Yes, a dingy boat. So someone may have been on a boat. But there's something that I thought it was Australia. If I'm not mistaken, I thought that was in Australia. Let me see. Dingy boat, Australia.
There's something with a dinghy boat in Australia. Hold on, let me see. Dinghy Australia. Oh, it's a boat race. So maybe somebody watches uh, boat racing on YouTube in Australia. So someone loves the Australian culture. They love the accent, they love the food, they love the atmosphere, they love everything. And they watch something with boats, extreme dinghy racing in Australia. So someone, someone watches a lot of like boat shows or they just like boating. Someone may love to crab or love to fish, okay? I'm hearing the cat skills as well, cat skills. I'm hearing the Roman pond, so I don't know what that is. Roman pond. So this family member or this ex-family member wanted you to be indecisive. They wanted you to delay your pay, your plans. They didn't want you to be open um, and, and move forward. They wanted you to feel trapped, so they may use a lot of wordplay. They may try to do a lot of mental manipulation. Okay, we do have the hangman here with them trying to stall your success. Okay, so they, again, they may try to emotionally try to manipulate you. No, I don't think you should do that because they're very dependent on you, on your energy. And I feel like you realize that the six of one, you said, let me get the fuck on up out of here. So you, 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 uh, you victorious, triumphant. Someone is looking into buying a Jag or a Jaguar. You're going to get it. All right. Ooh, I know that's right. Somebody's going to get a very expensive car. Ah! <laughs> that is dope. Somebody's going to get an expensive car. I know cars depreciate when you're going to get off the lot. But this person just worked really hard for where they, you know, to where they currently are. So they deserve it. Congratulations. Shit, I don't care if you buy the goddamn moon. You better be the most happiest motherfucker that you bought that moon, okay? Don't give a fuck about what nobody got to say about you. Shit, that's your money. And you won't spend it the way you want to spend it. Fuck them. We got V and N. So somebody could be very vain. Yeah, somebody's very superficial. They're into like money, into cars. But like I said, somebody had a nice car or a nicer car. Maybe they had the Jag and then they went down to a Buick. And there's nothing wrong with that. I'm just channeling what was being given to me. Um, but yeah, somebody's definitely not doing well. Could be not financially. The car is not working out or it's starting to like fall apart. So you may have been, you may have purchased a lemon car. Yep, it's time for you to surrender. You have no boundaries. You may tend to go over people's boundaries a lot. When somebody say no or somebody ignore you, you feel like ignoring you is like a no-no. So you take it upon yourself to go ahead and just kind of like exert yourself into somebody's uh, like presence and they don't like that. They don't like that shit at all. Clarify surrender. Yeah, there's no love here. There's no love here. Somebody may not want you to be in love or maybe have a family so they may try to destroy or mess with a family or your family. Your family could be friends. It could be uh, a family of like co-workers, okay? Family is, of, of friends that you call sisters, of family of friends that um, you know you call brother, okay? Take a high rest dates. But someone does not want you to have anything and they're willing to do anything to make sure that you don't get it. Anything that you don't get it, all right? They're very vain. Somebody could be going to Nevada. All right, one more. I have, I have C and I have I. We have a confidence here. A CI, somebody is a confident informer. So someone is giving information to another person in regards to what someone is doing here. You need to be very careful with that. Because I see that blowing up big like no matter what you do no matter what you say no matter what you try to hide it won't be able to be hidden compassion this person not going to have no compassion for you because even though you try to hide it the more that you try to hide it the more it will be exposed so it's not trying to hide whatever it is that you're trying to do it's just not going to work and i'm just telling you that but like always people don't listen to what i what i have to say because i i 
evidently I don't know anything, so. <laughs> and then they come back, shop like, girl, guess what? You know what you said was right, girl, this I don't lie. But I'm just here to forewarn, you know. Yeah, somebody could be doing magic on your, uh, like your, your social life. They have no compassion for you. They do not give a about you at all. They place harsh judgments on you, and they make sure they persevere with that 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 um that notion that um perception of you. They don't like you in no kind of way, brother. You may call your friend brother or sister instead of like bro or sis. Like, what up, brother? What up, sister? Like that. It could be from New Orleans or just Louisiana, but I'm here in New Orleans. I'm here in Gumbo. I hear that distinct accent from New Orleans. Like, hey, baby. <laughs> I can listen to them talk all day, child. Yeah, somebody is making a list against you, okay? Somebody's making a list to go against you or they, they're checking off something to make sure that, you know, you don't move forward. They may be writing it down in a journal to see the results, to see what they have, um, what manifests, what have not manifest. Yeah, they're stuck, in the, they're stuck enough in the past. This person is stuck in the past, but I'm telling you, this person talking about you like a dog. But yet they're dying from sepsis. So even though they're dying and they have the sepsis, they're still talking shit about you. You would think that something that's so uh, nerve-wracking would kind of humble them or chill them out. No, it's not. All right. So we got Pisces. We got Libra. We got Pisces. One more. We got Pisces. All right. So if that resonates, please like, share, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Until next time.